Indian origin Ajay Vanga has been appointed as the president of the World Bank for a five-year term beginning the 2nd of June. Now, born in Pune, the ex-Mastercard CEO Ajay Vanga has become the first person of Indian origin to head the World Bank. He most recently served as the vice chairman at General Atlantic. Vanga joins the list of Indian origin leaders heading global organizations. Take a look at his journey to the new World Bank president. From Pune to the World Bank headquarters in Washington, U.S. President Joe Biden's pick, Ajay Banga, becomes the new president of the World Bank. This comes at a moment. And will start his five year term beginning June 2nd. Born in Pune, Banga becomes the first person of Indian origin to head the World Bank. With an extensive career in the private sector, Banga credits his success to his army officer father. Two things are critical to success as a leader, humility and humor. I've had some great role models who have taught me that humility, the fact that you can learn, that you can interact, that you can, you can treat everybody with respect, with a hand on their back and not in their face, what, what we in our company call our decency quotient. Not just your IQ or your EQ, but your DQ. Ajay Banga most recently served as the vice chairperson at General Atlantic. Previously, he graduated from St. Stephen's College in Delhi and then completed his MBA from IIM Ahmedabad. Ajay Banga taking over the top post of the World Bank was expected as the position has always gone to a US candidate. Now the hope is that Mr. Banga's Indian origin would bring a first-hand understanding of the challenges that developing countries face in tackling poverty and climate change. But it's a challenging time to head the World Bank after the pandemic and the Ukraine war led to more economic trouble and poverty in several countries. Many say that it's the future of the World Bank that's at stake with this next appointment. Priyanshi Sharma for NDTV.